Ah! Yeah, That's right, baby. This is my ring. How did he do that? Let's find out. Sorcery. Welcome back, champs. Today, we are going to learn how to skin the cat. And to demonstrate that will be our most athletic coach, Coach K. Koa. Coach K, how did you do that? Let me show you. All right, champions, let me show you how to skin the cat today. So the first thing that you wanna do is make sure that your butt is at least on the apron or at least pressed against it. I see a lot of people make the mistake of going all the way to the floor and there's absolutely no way that you're gonna be able to recover from that. So try to make sure that you have a good base. Next thing is make sure that your hands are wide on the top rope. Sometimes people Make it too close, and I think that this actually dramatically helps my body get over the top rope. The next thing is people always try to just do a leg lift right to it. You need some lat strength. You need a little bit of back strength in order to do this, but definitely a lot of core strength. So when you do this, make sure you grab that top rope. Make sure that you try to pull down first. As you pull down, then start doing the leg lift over top. The easiest way to make sure that you accomplish this every single time is get the rope to your waist. If you can get the rope to your waist, basically momentum's gonna take you right on over. So like I said, wide grip, pull down first, legs together, get your waist to the top rope. And that's it. Now you know. Easy. I mean, I could definitely do that if I wanted to. Anyway, thank you guys for joining another episode of the House of Champions. How to. Hope you guys learned a thing or two. Go out and skin some cats. Not literally. Don't do that. Thanks for watching. <laughs>